everyone, it's another Chatty Tuesdays and today I was hugely inspired by Shutter Rock. They have this channel on YouTube, I think it's called Shutter Rock Share School. It's a bit of a tongue twister but anyway, it's an amazing resource. If you are a hobbyist or a professional or you know, if you like photography, love photography, whatever. If you want to learn more about photography, that is the one place that I advise you to go. Um, it's just in the beginning, but they have already had lots and lots of videos submitted from photographers all across the UK. And the whole point is that you're supposed to share experiences that you've learned that you wish someone had told you when you started photography. Um, it's all about sharing the lessons that you've learned and hopefully helping us to all grow together which I think is phenomenal and it's just amazing so today I thought I would jump on the bandwagon finally and submit a video of my own so I kind of struggled coming up with um, words of wisdom that I wish I could go back and tell myself because I have so many things that I wish I could go back and tell myself but then it kind of hit me that no matter what I had been able to go back in time and tell myself it really wouldn't have made a difference because I wouldn't have been experiencing it for myself and I think the only way that I would have really learned and the only way that it really would have impacted me as much as it did was for me to go out there and learn for myself so the one thing that I wish I could go back and tell myself it would definitely be to shoot more often um, the more that I shoot the more that I learn every single time that I go onto a photo shoot I come away learning something new and it's, I think it's pivotal um, for whether you're a professional photographer or an amateur photographer to go out and shoot as much as you possibly can. I know lots of you out there probably wait till you get paid work before you do any shooting but actually I think that the best thing for us as photographers as business people and artists is to shoot all the time as much as you can because then you get to know your style better and you learn a lot about how to interact with people and all, a lot of the questions that beginners have you learn f directly from shooting. So go out and shoot as much as you can. Always be asking yourself you know when was the last time that I shot? When was the last time that I did like a proper photo shoot? And if it was more than a week ago, then I think that's too long. So I always try now, since I've learned this lesson, I always try to organize photo shoots. I think that not only will it be good for your style, but it'll also help get your name out there and it'll get photos out there. And I think that's really important, especially at the beginning. So I hope that helps some of you out there and I hope that you all have a wonderful Tuesday. And I hope that you go and check out Shutter Rock because it is freaking awesome. Love to you all. Bye.